So before we open this, we are talking safety first. We need to remove the blades. In my case, I have like Kevlar on there or carbon fiber. So those are as sharp as knives. We need to remove them. Um, what direction do you turn them when you remove them? There's little arrows printed on those arms. That's the direction you have to turn it to loosen the, the blade. And here I'm gonna speed this up a little to do the last two and we insert a battery to and get the remote out to start this thing up to look at the problem we have. So this is a good startup. Um, oh, my gimbal is a little hung up here. Let's put the battery in. All the cables, they are not falling out when we try this. Remote on. So everything looks good. Let's start this up. It's not... Why not? Oh, here, I need to switch to manual. Yeah. There we go. Okay, now let's have a look at the lights, at the LEDs. One arm doesn't have lights on. Look at this. That one has lights on. This one does not. Or the other two, the green one in the back here has lights on. You see that? And the front one here does not. So, what's wrong? The motor is spinning, the craft is flying, but uh, the lights are off. Sometimes in flight they flicker. So, there's a big question, what's happening there? When you touch the motor, then the lights come off. That's normal, right? That's how it's supposed to be. Here. From there. Um, Yes, look at that, when you touch the motor while it's spinning, yeah, this one doesn't do any difference. So, yeah, doesn't look good. The question now is, what is wrong with it? 